Okay, so I just brought uh, parts IT175 in the shop. This is the one for parts. Uh, I'm selling it complete. Everything but the gas tank. And uh, that sprocket cover right there. So have a guy come and pick it up tomorrow. Uh, the reason why I'm selling it is I have a new toy coming home. And uh, that should be attached to the end of this video. So, Okay. So it's Saturday and I am on my way to go buy a new toy. So <laughs> it's a snapper model, I believe LT12 if I remember. Now it uses, the, I did a little research and my buddy actually used to have an LT16 I believe it is, I'd have to check with him. If I remember right, uh, they're the models that have the friction drive clutch or friction, friction drive for changing gears I guess. Uh, it has a side shaft 12.5 horsepower Briggs and it's the small twin so it's one of the smaller twin engines that I have ever seen uh, bad thing is it's about two hours outside the city and we just had a snowstorm and seeing my trucks warming up give a glimpse of how it looks out here so it's not that bad of course I made lots of room in the outside for it so I started up my truck let it warm up it's only about two inches, maybe four inches in the drift, so it's actually not that bad. So anyway, uh, it's not that cold out, as you can tell I'm in a t-shirt. Uh, it's still, I guess it would be minus uh, 10 or so Celsius, so anyway. I do got my winter jacket, I just was too lazy to put it on just to make that little clip. But anyway, <laughs> time for the fun part, sweet. He's just checking on my phone to see where the hell we gotta go. It's actually a cool town here. There's some pretty. It's not this town. It's not this town, the neck town? No. Uh, some pretty sweet ass looking hills in the back there for snowmobiling. So. So, anyway. Uh, I have the word Treherne. Whatever the hell that name is, right there. Treherne? Tre I have no idea. He shows a picture of Manitoba if that counts for anything. Yeah, it looks like Treherne. Anyway, this ain't the town here. The roads are actually not bad in town, but man, the highway, some parts were just glare ice, kind of like what? Huh? Are you no way, man. I don't mind driving holding one hand. I'm actually driving with my knee half the time, but anyway, yeah, it looks pretty glare icy coming up here, so I better slow down to the speed limit. Yeah, but coming up here is what the highway looked like here. You know, it's probably not smart to be driving by looking through my viewfinder. Maybe I should be driving by looking at the road, so anyway. Yeah, hey, look, a Ford dealership, if you want to call it that, a Ford dealership. They got, what, five cars? Oh, buddy, John Deere dealership, John Deere. We got to go pay a visit on the way back. Oh, is that slippery there. Okay, so uh, I'm not sure if you guys see what's behind me there, but uh, yeah, got the tractor. Uh, I also got a few other options, and uh, I'm not sure if this is going to show up here or not. Oh, I forgot about that. There's a snowmobile up on a pole there. That's a snowmobile. Anyway, uh, that's why I started the camera. Uh, but anyway, oh, I'm all out of focus now. God damn it, stupid camera. Never buy Canon again. Anyway, uh, I bought a couple chainsaws. I actually bought myself a spare motor for my Sears. Uh, believe it or not, he just happened to have a Sears uh, SS16 Owen engine in a shed. And I got the engine off them, I got two chainsaws and the tractor, so uh, by the time I get home now it's going to be a little bit dark, so I'm not going to be able to really show a video, and uh, I'm going to go to the car wash, give them a cleaning, and uh, yeah. So anyway, that's the end of this now for uh, now. Sweet. Okay, I thought before it's dark out, uh, I'd make a quick update video. So there's the Snapper model LT12, has a pretty decent mold deck. Uh, there's the Owen 16, it's all taken apart right now. It actually was burning oil, so he took it apart. Found the price of the rings and then pretty much said screw it. He repowered his Sears Suburban uh, with some other engine and then ended up selling it. So the Snapper seems to be in okay shape. And check this out, a twin model 25, 025s, two of them. They're both parts only kind of thing, but they have the chain, the bars in the bottom. Uh, he doesn't really know what shape they're in. You can see that one there is kind of broken there. Uh, but between the two of them, I'm sure I could probably make one. But anyway, got these off him. Very cool guy, uh, very nice. Uh, so, uh, just kind of want to make a little bit of an update, kind of show this stuff, because I'm bringing it to the car wash. And uh, yeah, 
Just thought I'd make an update before I get there. Even got a spare exhaust there for my tractor, so yeah, sweet. And look at that. Why didn't I catch that when I was outside doing my video? Look at the sky, hey? Eh? That is so cool. That is freaking wicked. But I'm going up onto a turn here, and it's a pretty icy turn. So I can't really look beside me through my camera and do the turn. So, <laughs> anyway, that is freaking awesome, that roof, or uh, freaking sky. Man, why didn't I think of looking at that like when I was outside, eh? Holy shit. Anyway, that is sweet. Okay, I'm just gonna make my update video here. My glasses are pretty fogged up. Just went in a, well, a few hours ago, an hour ago. Sprayed it down with some of that shit. We went and uh, ate some mixed squirts. Or not quite, did you just do it? I think you were doing it on the video. Every fucking seed. So, side by side comparison, size wise. It's quite a bit skinnier. Tires are pretty much lined up. <laughs> Look how skinny those tires are. That is nuts how skinny those tires are. Even your suits of ribbon are, narrow, are narrower than mine. Yeah. My 16's wider. Oh, of course, that's not even going to show up there. It's a horizontal shaft, 12.5 horsepower. Mr. Horizontal. Hey, the fuel line fell off. It must have been pretty rotten. You can turn those mufflers around. I know. And Put it them stacks. upside down. <laughs> what do you mean upside down? Uh. Backwards? Oh yeah, it would be backwards, eh? Hmm. Electric PTO at the front. True dual exhaust. Anyway. True dual exhaust. There's just two fucking mufflers bolted to the block. Hey, anyway. <laughs> Time to go drop off this whiny bastard and uh, I'll maybe play around with it tomorrow, sweet.